So in this video, we're going to take a quick look at the dashboard in Smart Toolbox. Uh, the dashboard is designed to allow our customers to quickly find what they are looking for, as well as identify tasks that may need to be completed, or just keep an eye on the overall health of the business as a whole. It can be easily customized for each individual user, and most of the widgets or tiles can be configured to show figures at a business level, or limited down to a branch or just a single team member. Uh, over here we can see quotes, work orders, purchase orders, and invoices are all broken down into groups or statuses. And these statuses will often update automatically uh, as you move jobs through the job cycle. For example, if you email a quote out to uh, one of your customers, we can mark it as sent to customer. And same with a purchase order. If you send it through to one of your vendors, it gets marked as sent to the supplier. Um, that'll also automatically trigger the awaiting delivery status. So you can see over here we have six purchase orders awaiting delivery right now. So if I click on this tile, uh, I'll bring up a list of the purchase orders in question and I can see who the supplier is, when each one was ordered, when it's expected, the consignee or the customer, uh, the delivery address, items outstanding, and the user who is responsible for it in our system. You can click on any of these to get detail. So if we double click on this one here, I can look into the item, into the job, or the purchase order. I can view it. So maybe a truck's arrived, no one knows what's going on. They can quickly bring up a copy of the order on screen, or they can print it. Look at each panel to check that all of the pieces of glass that were required have been delivered, and that if you want to, you know, they match exactly what we ordered. Uh, if you say were to talk to the supplier and they mentioned that it was going to be a couple of days behind schedule, you could make a note in the job diary and then come through and update the expected date. And that will reduce once I save this. If we have a look here, I currently have three purchase orders overdue. If I save that and close out of here, that will recalculate and drop it down to just two purchase orders overdue. So a couple of other uh, useful statuses that we track in the software, and you can see them here. Measurements required. So these three jobs have all been marked uh, as not accurately measured or have final measurements required or outstanding. Uh, this is a flag that's pretty useful and will stop a user from actually being able to order any glass until they have been marked as accurately measured. Uh, we can also see things with deposits that are outstanding. We can even see jobs that are ready to install or ready to invoice. Um, all the statuses in Smart Toolbox have been added to help you guys keep track of what's going on and see uh, what still needs to be done. So that's a pretty quick overview of the dashboard in Smart Toolbox. hope that gives you a good idea. And remember, you can let me know if you want to see an in-depth online demonstration uh, and I'll be able to jump online and walk you through it.